Good morning, HMS, and welcome to the WBUC Morning News for Friday, December 17th, 2021, Rotation Day 6. I'm Mrs. Scheller. Please rise as we begin the day together with the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Please be seated. Here are your announcements for today. The library is open for grab and go during Explore time today. All band members are reminded that there is no rehearsal this morning. All choir members are reminded that you have a dress rehearsal today. Please report to the auditorium at the start of Explore time and you will be rehearsing until 11 o'clock a.m. Mrs. Jackson says a huge thank you again to everyone who donated to the Pet Supply Drive for Animal Protectors. The winners of the $10 gift cards are Jordan Litz and Cadence Lang. Please go to room 206 to claim your prize. To everyone else, thank you again. The Student Council is selling candy grams today during Explore and ER times. They will be a dollar each, so make sure to purchase a candy gram for your friends. Thanks to everyone who has been participating in the Holiday School Spirit Days. Today is Ugly Sweater Day. Monday is Holiday Pajamas, so break out your school-appropriate holiday pajamas for Monday. And we hope everyone will participate and join in on the school spirit and some holiday fun. Happy Birthday Friday to Jackson Cruz, Chloe D'Amico, Layla Cariotis, and Maddie Seal. And have a happy birthday Saturday to Lily Fernier and Braden Guitardo. We all hope that you have a great weekend celebrating. And now for your WBUC weather forecast. Today we will see a high of 49 degrees with some sun in the morning and increasing clouds in the afternoon. Tonight temperatures will fall to 39 degrees with showers early, becoming a steady rain later on today. Saturday and Sunday, temperatures will continue to fall from 52 degrees to 38 degrees as the weekend progresses with continued rain and clouds. And that is your WBUC weather forecast. Happy National Maple Syrup Day, HMS. The origins of the production of maple syrup can be traced back thousands of years to the northeastern region of the United States. There it was first gleaned from the abundant maple tree population by indigenous peoples. While it is uncertain as to how and why exactly the extraction process first began, it is arguable that maple sap became a key ingredient in a variety of dishes. Namely, a key ingredient in breakfast made famous by one of our favorite holiday characters. You know that the four main food groups for every elf are candy, candy cane, candy corn, and syrup. So whenever I got my breakfast ready this morning, I got a delicious plate of spaghetti ready to go. And you know, I thought I had some, some syrup here somewhere. Let me check in my... Check. Oh yes, I have some right here. And yes, just delicious maple syrup to add to my, my breakfast. And mmm, ah, that sounds so good. Um, wonder if I have anything else that would be good for... Oh yes! Yum! this I'm like yes mm -hmm. delicious well we will let you go off now and get ready for your day make sure today at some point you enjoy some maple syrup on this national maple syrup day put it on your favorite foods mix it in with some of your favorite ingredients mmm mm, the sugar just smells the mmm mm, smells delicious mmm 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 mm. Have a great day.